Hey there, I'm Carly. The Harry Potter stars step out and reflect on their characters as the countdown to the end begins in today's Pop Sugar Rush. Emma Watson joined Rupert Grint and most of the cast of Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows Part 2 for a photo call in London today. The stars were all decked out ahead of their big world premiere tomorrow. Well, fans have been lining up since Monday to get a good spot on the red carpet in London, and since it's the final film in the franchise, it's their last chance to experience all the excitement of a Harry Potter movie premiere. Daniel Radcliffe, Emma, and Rupert have all grown up on screen as they landed the roles more than 10 years ago. It will be the end of an era, the end of a decade, uh, the end of my teenage years. But it's not just the actors who have changed over time. The stars say their characters have too. Emma admits that brainy Hermione isn't as frazzled as she's been before, while Rupert says Ron is braver than ever. In the earlier films, he was kind of quite easily scared. You don't really see any kind of evidence of that in, in, uh, in this Ron, in this film. He's really kind of grown up, I think. Hermione's just pretty heroic through the whole thing, to be honest. Um, she keeps a cool head in some difficult situations. Meanwhile, Daniel reveals that a mid-battle kiss between Harry and Ginny was his idea. Um, I, I said we should, we should, we'd probably kiss at this moment, wouldn't we? It might be one of those sort of like, I could be dead any minute now, Ginny. We should probably kiss. The final film is really all about this big battle at Hogwarts, but it's nice to know that we're going to see a little bit of romance before it all comes to an end. Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows Part 2 opens in theaters Friday, July 15th.